Yo, what's going on YouTube? It's your boy Alex Thomas here, back with another video for you guys. Yes, it is Tuesday, another Blues Day Tuesday, another Blu-ray hunt trip for you guys. Today, we got a couple releases coming out today. We got um, Heavy Metal is coming out on 4K. I think that's from Kino, if I'm not mistaken. Then we got In the Heat of the Night also coming out. We got a Lionsgate Steelbook coming out that's in Cabin in the Woods on 4K. It's coming out. Hopefully, they have it in the store. I guess we'll check to see if they do have it. Um, that's really the only uh, couple things I think of. Like, oh, Jackass Forever also comes out today, which I probably would not be buying because I have none of the other Jackass movies in, on physical. So, um, yeah, let's go ahead and see what they got out here. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Please hit that like button. Please subscribe for more. If you guys enjoyed my content, I really appreciate it. If you guys hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell, stay updated on my videos. I really appreciate that as well. Enough rambling. Let's get into the video. Let's get it. Let's go. All right, you guys. We made it to our first destination, and that is The Exchange. I haven't been to this exchange in a while, so let's see if they got any new type of inventory in it. Um, let's get it, let's go. All right, you guys, on our way to The Exchange to see what they got in there for us today. Let's go. All right, you guys, we got the exchange. I did pick up a couple titles in there. You guys know the drum, I'll show you guys in the end of the video what I picked up. Now let's head to our next destination, and that is Best Buy. Let's see if they got the Cabin in the Woods Steelbook in stock. Let's get it, let's go. All right, you guys, made it to our next destination, that is Best Buy. Let's go and see if they got Cabin in the Woods Steelbook in stock. Let's get it, let's go. And to Best Buy we go. Let's see if what they got in stock for us today. All right, you guys, over by the new release section. And yes, they do. They have Cabin in the Woods, the Best Buy exclusives steelbook. I thought the disc was loose. It thought sounded like this was, this was loose. We got Heavy Metal here, the Blu-ray and Digital. Oh, this is not in Kino. This is, oh, it's, getting, it's gotten both Heavy Metal and Heavy Metal 2000. Oh, it's a two movie collection. That's what that is, okay. I was confused on what that was, what that whole deal was. It's a loose disc in here. I knew I wasn't tripping. It's a loose disc. Oh, do they all got loose discs? 
Okay, that sounds like a good one. They all got loose disc. Shit. Goodness. All right. So yeah, let's check the other side. What's over here? Same old stuff as last week. What is over on this side? Still got a lot of Spider-Man No Way Home on 4K and Blu-ray. No slipcover, unfortunately. Still got this beast right here. I'm really debating on buying it. Got a lot of Dexter New Blood Steelbook and still in stock. Still got some Scream. No Scream Steelbook. It's actually on sale actually right now. But that's it. Let's go over to the new Blu-ray, uh, the other Blu-ray section and see what they got. All right, guys, by the other Blu-ray section, and I still not seeing anything else new. And that's look, they do got RoboCop in stock. It's funny in my store; it's not even showing that this is available at all. Still debating on getting that. I don't know yet. I guess we'll see. Um, still got copies of No Way Home still in stock on Blu-ray. And actually, here goes one with the slipcover. I actually do like the slipcover better than this slipcover for some reason. So yeah. Um, anything else that is new? I'm not seeing anything. They they do have. Still Frankenstein in stock. Here goes Jackass Forever. That is also, I think, The Humans is new. I think this is new. I don't remember seeing this last week. Um, anything else? I think some of these steelbooks are new as well. My Hero Academia, I think that's new. Anything else? I'm not really seeing anything else that is catching my eye. No, I'm not seeing anything else that catch my eye. Wow, the no, size of the lamb. I say, wow, the Three from Hell steelbook is finally gone. Wow, okay, well, all right, let's all run here. Nope, nothing, nothing. Not seeing anything else that's different. Check on this side, nothing. Anything on this side, nope, same old stuff as last week. Nothing is new, nothing has changed. Nope, 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 nope. Same old stuff. <gasps> wow, they got this in stock, guys. They got it in stock. Should I get it? Should I get it? Should I get it? Oh, my Lord. All right, you guys, just got a Best Buy. Um, I did pick up a couple things in there. Um, so saw some stuff that I was surprised I didn't see. I, I don't know if I showed in the video, but it actually had Halloween, the first one, the Screen Factory version in stores, actually. And I did see the three pack with Halloween H2O, uh, Curse of Michael Myers, and Resurrection actually in there. That's something you don't really see every time you go in there. So um, yeah, uh, we're gonna head to our next destination, and that is Half Price Books. And then I'm going to end it and then do the uh, Spider-Man No Way Home code giveaway. Let's see who won digital code. Let's get it. Let's go. All right, you guys. Made it outside of Half Price Books. Let's see what they got in here. It's been a while since I've been in here. So let's see if they got any new inventory. Like I said, this store rarely, really gets new inventory as I can see. Usually when I go there, it's the same stuff. Obviously, I always check the clearance first. But if there's a lot of people around, I probably won't get that much film. So let's go and see what they got in here for us today. All right, heading into Half Price Books to see what they got for us today. I can't remember all the spy stories I used to buy. That's right.
All right, you guys, just got to have price books. Did pick up a couple things from in there. Obviously, you guys already know at the end of the video, I'm gonna show you guys what I picked up. Now, let's head to the house. I'm gonna show you guys what I picked up, and then I'm going to do the Spider Man No Way Home digital code giveaway to two subscribers from the last video. So, let's go ahead and head home. All right, you guys, we made it back home for Blu ray hunting. Now, it's time to show you guys what I picked up today from a couple stores. I got some from Best Buy, Half Price Books, and The Exchange. So, I got some from each store. Let's go ahead and start off with some of these pickups. And let's go ahead and start off with the exchange pickups. And the two things I picked up from the exchange. First thing I picked up is the Shia LaBeouf in Charlie Countryman. I've never heard of it. Um, it has a decent looking uh, little cast. We got Mads Mikkelsen, Rupert Grant, uh, Vincent D'Onofrio, um, obviously Shia LaBeouf. Um, I don't know. I've never seen this before. Um, it looks pretty interesting. So yeah, I picked this up. It's called uh, Charlie uh, Countryman. And then next, uh, the next title I picked up from there was Cinderella Man. I don't, I didn't have this movie at all in my collection. Uh, Russell Crowe is great in this movie. Did Ron Howard? Yeah, Ron Howard also directed this as well. Um, so yeah, I figured I'd pick up um, Cinderella, Cinderella Man. So yeah, picked that up from the exchange. Now let's go ahead and go into the half price books picked up. I picked up these two titles because they were on in clearance. So I picked up The Fifth Element. Um, I didn't have this movie at all in my collection as well. Clearly, we got Bruce Willis. He did uh, announce his retirement, so I might as well go ahead and pick up some of his films that he's most known for. Um, and uh, he's also obviously known for this one. So yeah, uh, The Fifth Element. It was only three dollars at Half Price Books. And the final title I picked up from Half Price Books, and my buddy Todd is probably gonna be surprised about this one, and that is uh, In the Heights. It was only three bucks on Blu-ray. Um, it comes with the digital. I don't know if it's been used, but it doesn't come with the um, it doesn't come with the um, the DVD. It just comes with the Blu-ray. So I guess that's why it's three dollars. So um, I did pick up in the Heights, Tyler. So I finally have it in my collection. I don't know if I'm gonna watch it, but I did get it because of you. All right, now let's go ahead and get into the Best Buy pickups. And you guys already know what they are. Now this first one I picked up, I saw it. I said, Oh my God, I actually have it in stores, and I did buy it. And that is. The Planet of the Apes, the three film collection, yo, for $25. So I got three movies for $25 on 4K and Blu-ray with a digital code. And yeah, so I'm very happy to have these in my collection. A great trilogy. No one really talks about these movies. Ooh, excuse me. If you guys have not seen these movies, definitely check them out, you guys. Very happy to have in my collection. Now I can get rid of my Blu-rays. You know, I can sell off my Blu-rays. And the final pickup I picked up today, yes, I did pick up this steel book and that is the cabin in the woods another upgrade i do have the blu-ray i can get rid of the blu-ray because i have the 4k now it comes with the uh the, the blu-ray and the digital so i don't need the 4k the blu-ray anymore so yeah let me go ahead and open this up and show you guys what is all this is all about show you guys the slip so we got the front and then we're going to slide it up and this is the whole steel book and there's the front and the back of the steelbook, you guys. Nice little image. I like it. I think the back is probably the, the, one of the dopest on it for real. Uh, it's a dope back, though, but it's a nice little Lionsgate steelbook. Now I see it in person. I saw the images on the line. I'm like, I don't know if I like that that much, but seeing it in person, I'm like, yo, yeah, I do like the steelbook. So, yeah, um, Cabin in the Woods, the Best Buy exclusive uh, Lionsgate steelbook. And that does it for my pickups. Now, you guys, the moment you guys have been waiting for, time to announce the winners for the um, the Spider-Man No Way Home uh, digital code. I have two of them, so I'll be picking two winners. So let's go ahead and do this. We're gonna do this live. I didn't, I'm gonna go ahead and do this live. So let's start. Our first winner will be... All right, our first winner is Punk Nerd. You won the first digital code for Spider-Man No Way Home. If you guys are following me on Instagram, go hit me up on Instagram at Alex underscore Thomas underscore reviews on Instagram to get your code. So Punk Nerd, you have won the first code. Now let's pick the second winner. All right, we got our next winner and that is Furman Castro. You have won the second code, guys. Uh, so we got Punk Nerd and uh, Furman, Fernan. Fernand Castro, sorry if I uh, mispronounce your name, but you guys have won the digital codes for Spider-Man No Way Home. 
please hit that like button. Please subscribe for more. Like I said, if you got for the winners, please hit me up on Instagram at um, Alex underscore Thomas underscore reviews to get your digital code. Thank you all you guys for checking out that last video. I really appreciate you guys. If you guys enjoyed this video, please hit that like button. Please subscribe for more. More videos will be coming in the near future. I'll be guys ready for that as well. Today, um, at 7.30, I will be on my Mind of a Nerd Reviews YouTube channel. We'll be ranking every single Harry Potter movie, including Fantastic Beasts and Secrets of Dumbledore. If you guys are ready to see that, go check out Mind of a Nerd Reviews on YouTube to see me on there. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please hit that like button. Please subscribe for more. And I'm on this one, you guys. Peace out.